Girls, I have Mama31409 with me today. <laughs> and during Black Friday, I ordered an Ancestry DNA kit. And I filmed the little process of me like sending in, doing this and sending it in. So I'll insert that in a minute. But uh, yeah, I got this on sale for like $50 during Black Friday, I think. Yeah, it was really cool. So uh, yeah, I did pay for this, it's not sponsored. Okay, so I got my Ancestry DNA kit in the mail the other day and I read through all of the instructions, well not all of them entirely, I did the activation. First and foremost you have to activate your kit, otherwise it won't be valid or anything like that. So I just went on the AncestryDNA.com, you know, little website thing and I activated Activated it and it had me input like my legal name like my real name and my birth date and then it allowed me to kind of start a family tree which is what I'm in the process of doing online right now but my kit is activated and then number two gather your DNA so there's this little instruction pamphlet in here that tells you how to spit in a tube and seal it up properly so you can send it back in and then it has this little collection bag where you put the little tube in then it has the little tube and this little stuff in here I think that's the stuff you're supposed to swish around in your mouth I don't know 100% sure we're gonna figure that out together and then there is a little um, pre-packaged and labeled little mailer here so you just put your little spit in the little tube in there and then you send it to the address which is actually in Utah um, I ordered this for the Black Friday deal and I got it in the mail within like four days if that so it got to me really quick so I'm hoping it'll send rather quickly so in here is the little tube I'm gonna go ahead and read through the um, little directions and I will get back to you guys and show you the process of putting my DNA in the tube and packaging it to send it off so it does say that you have to wait 30 minutes after eating drinking smoking or chewing gum before uh, giving your saliva sample so I did actually just take a drink so I'm gonna wait 30 minutes but I just wanted to show you guys the exact step-by-step -step directions in case you were curious how all this works uh, you fill the tube with the saliva to the black wavy line just like the little diagram shows you remove the little funnel with the cap that is included which you can see right here with that little blue substance and that is the solution that will stabilize the DNA in your saliva. Tighten to release stabilizing fluid. You will know it works when the blue solution from the cap has emptied into the tube. So it's supposed to mix in there. It says, shake the tube for at least five seconds. This will ensure your sample mixes thoroughly with the stabilizing solution so our lab can process your sample. And then place the tube in the collection bag, place the sample inside collection bag provided in your DNA kit, seal the bag with the adhesive strip, and mail in your sample. So yeah, I am going to wait 30 minutes. It is currently 8, 11 p.m. So I'm gonna wait 30 minutes and I will come back and spit in this little tube, like I said before. Okay, I'm back. It has been 30 minutes. And I am now going to do this little tube thing. Here is the tube itself. And you are supposed to spit to this line right here. I don't know if that's going to focus. It says right here. And I think it actually starts right here. So you're not like filling up this whole entire section right here because in the instructions it says it's like less than a quarter of a teaspoon, which is literally only like this much. So you're not filling up the whole entire tube, just about to that line from there and it says minus the bubbles so i'm gonna go ahead and spit in this tube and don't overfill is what it said so i'm gonna go ahead and do that right now i'm kind of like tapping it on the side so it all falls down because a lot of it is kind of getting stuck in that little funnel 
if this grosses you out I'm sorry but you can see there is my saliva and that is the fill line so just a little bit more to go because you are not supposed to count the bubbles the bubbles can go over the line but you're supposed to fill it up with just your spit minus the bubbles to that line so that that is darn near as close as I can get you guys can kind of see where the wavy line is that's where you want it to be okay so next what you have to do is remove this um, little funnel and then put on this that came with the kit and it has the little stabilizer fluid in there and I think you just screw this on here I'm going to do it, it says tightly so I gotta go real tightly and it hasn't released yet oh there it goes it just released can you guys see this now it's in there see it in there okay then it said to shake for at least five seconds so one Mississippi two Mississippi three Mississippi four Mississippi five Mississippi and we'll do six just to be on the safe side okay so that's what it looks like this is what we have if it'll focus this is what we have to send in so flopping this in the little sample bag seal the bag with the adhesive strip so yep I'm gonna leave that little cloth piece in there and then I'm gonna seal this up nice and tight just like so and then put it in this little box and uh, peeling the strip I'm like excited about this I'm nervous but I'm excited and then it is sealed and ready to be shipped I am excited and the reason I have my mom here is so she can tell you like what she told me all the years growing up what my ethnicity is and my background and all that stuff and we're gonna see if it's accurate so tell them what you told me over the years so that they can get an idea people always ask me what is your ethnicity what are you and I just I don't know I always tell them I'm a mutt like I'm a Heinz 57 I'm a mix of everything cuz what am I? What what are what are what are ones that you know are in the line? Like okay, what I've been told from my grandmother, who would have been your great grandmother on my mother's side, they said that my grandfather he came over from England, but he was actually from. I believe it was Norway. It was one of the ones that started with the N, but it wasn't the Netherlands. It wasn't the, no, not, yeah, maybe Normandy. Normandy or Norway? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was Normandy. But anyway, he went to England and then he came over to the States. On my mother's side of the family, they were from the country in the South and I think I believe Kentucky but we were related to Lori Ingalls Wilder on that side of the family um, my husband his grandmother on his mom's side was from England or excuse me Germany um, that's what they always thought um, me being adopted, I don't know about my original heritage, um, but my adoptive family, they are, they always said they were Scotch-Irish and they were very proud of that. <laughs> but, um, anyway, I'm excited to find out if any of that matches up with what we think. We think. <laughs> so, All here, right, so here goes nothing. They emailed me the results. But it says, you're about to discover your ethnicity estimate, get a unique look at your family's journey through generations, and maybe even connect with long lost relatives. So, I think I have to sign into my little account here. Oh, see, oh it already popped up, it already popped up. Okay, let's see. 51% Europe West, 
21% Ireland, Scotland, and Wales. Scotch Irish, oh my goodness. And it says seven other regions, so oh hold on. Oh my goodness. Let me keep going, let me keep going, hold on. That was my adoption. Scandinavia, <laughs> that's why I'm so pale. <laughs> yes. wait, wait, Great wait. Britain. Okay, start at the beginning. So here's, here. tell him. Okay, so. Scotch Irish, I can't believe that. 51% Europe West, I'll put Which it on the screen. Normandy. Uh, 21% Ireland, Scotland, and Wales, 10% Great Britain, and 8% Scandinavia. Oh my lord, she really is a princess! <laughs> See, I was wondering where my super pale skin tone came from. Oh, but you know, you're like, they're gonna name the new Harry's wife is gonna be the Duchess of Sussex. <laughs> And Su Su Sussex, yeah, Sussex, the Duchess Here of Sussex. Here it shows you like all the migrations and, and everything. Eastern Kentucky, see Kentucky, this see? Says there's 150 regions. Wow, and then it brought up a map so it shows like where everywhere is and what percentage. That's so cool. It is so neat that it's so right on. But did you see any Germany? Or is that the European Western or whatever? Europe, my geography is so bad. You guys don't get mad at me, please. Oh, <laughs> I'm worse. I just wanted to know where I came from. So this is cool. <laughs> Now I can now tell she you guys. Can believe me when I tell her she's Heinz 57. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, I'm a little bit of a lot. Oh, that Scotch Irish one was the one that surprised me. Scotch so I'm Irish, I'm Scottish. I'm I don't, I can't even do accents or anything. I'm so American. <laughs> We gotta watch that dragon movie again. I love that dragon, dragon movie. movie. Yeah, where it was in Ireland. Oh, the Pete's dragon? No. Yeah. No. That was the one where they had the heavy accents. Or are you talking about Water Horse? No. I think so. No, I think yeah. Pete's dragon was the one with the accents. But remind us in the comments below. Yeah, yeah, let us <laughs> know us. please, because we can't remember. It's Christmas. I got my results on Christmas, so this is a cool Christmas present for us right now. Yeah. Yeah, and then mom's new bird is back here. Yeah, she's so pretty. She's kind of hidden. Oh, she's, oh, yeah, she's, she is she's, hiding. She's, she's hiding. Completely she's hiding. camera shy, apparently. Yeah, so anyone who ever wondered what I am, here you go. That's what I am. That's cool. That was exciting. I like it. <laughs> anyway, final thoughts? Anything you have left to say to anybody? Oh, I encourage anyone to do this. Like, it is so fun to figure it out. Well, I it. have, you know, like books, stacks of books for, with our history on all different sides of the family that I've got tucked away. But um, this is a lot faster and easier. It took, okay, I want to tell you guys, um, you guys will see the footage of me like sending it in and everything like I said I'll insert that or whatever if I haven't already but it took um I think six weeks no four weeks it didn't take too long to get it the results once they were in fast it, it took no really longer fast. than um well I bought it on Black Friday and it's just barely Christmas so it didn't barely even take a month for and the whole process. she got on Christmas Day. Yeah, that, that was something? so cool. <laughs> so we got several Christmas miracles this year. Okay, I'm gonna let you guys go. And uh, let me know in the comments if you wanna see more videos with my mom. Maybe we can do a question and answer type video or something. I don't know. Do you have any cool video ideas you wanna do? Where they ask you questions and you can talk to them or like. Oh, I could do that. Yeah. Maybe. They love you. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. No, well, it's not funny. It's nice. I, I, it's no, sweet. kids like me. I used to be the Kool-Aid mom, you know. They don't used to be? You still are. And not you're really. You're like Kool-Aid grandma now, but you're good. You're great. Everyone I loves try. You. If I can't do Kool-Aid, I do juice now. <laughs> juice. <laughs> <laughs> Cranberry grape. <laughs> yes. So that's what you get when you come to Graham's house. We're gonna go, I guess, and spend the yeah. rest of our Christmas together. Yeah. And yeah, it's it's 
I was gonna say it's pouring snow, but it, it <laughs> snowed a lot last night. So we have like, how much snow? Like, I don't five, know. Five, six inches or something? I know I there's know. a bunch of kids sledding on the hill outdoors. So mm -hmm. yeah, they're having a good time. Sounds like it's time to go watch Christmas Vacation again. <laughs> oh my gosh, you've already watched it like four times. But I, it's her I like to have it in the background when I'm cooking and doing stuff, so. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go watch movies and hang out and I will see you guys later. You gotta do my outro. I, that's why I set down okay. the coffee cup. I do. So long. Stay, Stay strong. strong. Stay, Stay true. true. You gotta do your other oh. hand. <laughs> Stay true. <laughs> Every time. Be you. Be you. Bye. 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 <laughs>